Today, this video is going to be testing to see if these little babies, curl formers, work on type four hair, thick hair, also known as black girl hair. We are going to see if that works because if we're gonna be speaking candidly, a lot of these hair accessories, these hair tools, anything that you're seeing that's trending is more catered to the people that have finer hair. So I wanna see if these things work on my thick hair and anybody that has a similar hair texture to me. Fingers crossed and we will see what the end result will be. So if you are interested, stay tuned. And if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button, turn on those bells, and already give this video a thumbs up because I have a good feeling. So let's get into it. All right, y'all. The goal is to not have to do a voiceover because I would prefer not to have to do that. So I will be using these little clips these clips products i'm using today a spray bottle because my hair is probably going to be dry midway through the spray bottle is filled with aloe vera juice the long lux grow yogurt hope this is supposed to be super amazing it is a leave-in conditioner main choice heavenly halo softening milk so that is my lock method Now, obviously, um, I could just blow my hair out before I do all this, and I'm sure that would cut a lot of time for the curl formers, but um, I want to see if I can do it without heat. If you're a natural, I guess it's always the goal to stay away from heat because it's no good for our hair, supposedly. My hair is also detangled at this point, so if you're wondering how I am sliding my fingers through here, focus on the ends. Praise hands two full pumps of this halo milk, whatever. All right, so after that, I'm going to split it into smaller sections. Clip that up. Orange and pink, same size. The curls are just gonna be going in different directions. So what I'm gonna do one whole side, one color, and the other side, the alternate color. It comes with this stick and you take it and you slide it on or slide it through and it actually tells you that you use it facing this way up so you're gonna want to put your hair in through here it's a little hook then you're gonna pull it through so just a recap before I do it hair in making sure it's facing this way up squeeze this just a little bit so it can get through and you pull okay okay I'm gonna try to do as many as I can it's I twist my root just a little bit making sure this is up push that forward and pull through oh yes went right in and it's as simple as that yes we're gonna do the same thing push this in Take it, pull through. And I'm assuming the smaller the sections, the better. Y'all, we got a problem. I ran out. I got one more section. All right, that's mad random, but that's the best I can do right now because I don't have a supplement. I'm gonna leave these in overnight. I'm probably only gonna sit under the dryer for like 30 minutes. One try. I'm a little mushroom. Yeah. 
I will show y'all what my hair looks like tomorrow. All right, I'm about to run out to work. This is the end result. I pinned it back. I think it's cute. The curls are very like bouncy and spirally. All right, I'm running late, gotta go. Thanks for watching. If you watched until this point, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Turn on those post notifications, and I will catch y'all in the next video. Bye.